It's what makes scotch? scotch yeah, tape. why a scotch tape scotch? Because it's plaid. <laughs> it's a plaid piece of no, tape. No, it's not. It plays the it's bagpipes. Secret. Its name is McCatherty, and it plays the bagpipes, and it drinks some scotch. That's why scotch tape is scotch. Welcome to another episode of Three Minute Critics. I am Eric. I'm Tony. Mm, yes, Tonight, yes. today, today, this afternoon, Whatever this morning, yeah. on Three Minute Critics. What are we doing? We are going to be reviewing a film. A film. I'm glad you asked. I like this films. film is called News of the World. News of the World. New film, rated PG-13, starring Tom Thanks. Hanks. As some people know him, thanks. Yes. Helena Dingle. Yes. You like that pronunciation? I do. That. I got wow. a little. T- You've been practicing. Z- I can yeah. tell. She's German. Who directed this? This was directed by Call, Paul or Call yeah, Paul, Greengrass. Yeah. And Eric is going to tell us what this film is about. I'm going to uh, dig in here. Uh, five years after the end of the Civil War, Captain Jefferson Kyle Kidd, played by Tom Hanks, travels the country reading the news of the nation to local towns. He crosses paths with an abandoned 10-year-old girl taken by the... Kiowa. People. Forced to return to her aunt and uncle, Kid agrees to escort the child across the harsh and unforgiving plains of Texas. The long journey soon turns into a fight for survival, as the traveling companions encounter danger at every turn, both human and Spiritual? natural. Oh, you natural. thought I was going to say I didn't know what unhu- you were going to say. Inhuman, yeah, uh, paranormal. Uh, well, you know, movie. let's let's talk about the news. Okay. All right, we're going to put three minutes on the clock, and Tony. News of the world. What did you think of this film? You know, I, I got the feeling from Mr. Hanks. From Mr. Hanks, well, that. That, I mean, it was, felt very one note to me. He was very, very solemn the whole time, and I didn't feel like there was any development happening with that character. You mm. know what it reminded me of this film? Do like, tell. Or it felt like what they were going for was. was True Grit, but I don't feel like it landed there. You've got. Oh, I can see the similarities. With the young girl across, yeah. and they become friends, and then they have their, you know, their trials and tribulations, and then they end up, you know, but a very different having a relationship. Relationship between Not what you have in True Grit. Different. Yeah. I, but Fairly here's different. the difference for me between okay. True Grit and News of the World. The character played originally by John Wayne, and then later by Jeff Bridges in the remake by the Coen Brothers, which are both great. If you yeah. haven't seen those, oh, see yeah, both. The the difference is that character played by originally John Wayne is so much more interesting and develops, has an arc. And you felt and like Tom felt Hanks like didn't they, yeah, get there. I felt this. like he started where he ended, and I don't feel like there was much development of his character. So I, I just didn't love it. I got bored. What did you think? I could not uh, disagree more. Okay. I really, I felt like uh, the, there was more than that one dimension to Hanks's character. I really think his relationship to uh, Johanna, uh, Helena Zengel, uh, Helena was Zengel. was great. I mean, Hanks has a knack for being able to uh, like hold both sides of conversation, like with a volleyball in Castaway and, and here uh, with a child that doesn't necessarily yeah, speak the language. Yeah, but that's arguable because I hated <laughs> Castaway. But, ba- but back to this, I th- there's, there's so much going on in this film. You have, I always felt a a sense of uneasiness. And I mean that in a good way. Wait, because what there was, was uneasy? A, a sense of uneasiness what, throughout the... About? Every, because no matter where they went, there was something okay, that was yes. like coming to... Get, they had a problem. Yeah, you're crossing the freaking prairie. It's an old, old, right, old right. story. But they did what they didn't have hmm. was an interesting character. Uh, I thought the kid's character was far more interesting. I thought she had more of an arc. And she I developed... I thought they worked really and well. And the reason they played why off each that, other together. that relationship worked at all was because of her, not Hanks. That, I don't think Hanks' character was written very well, and I don't think he performed it with any kind oh, of dynamics. Oh, no, I do. There I were think no it, dynamics in his I know, he, because, I mean, he's, a, he's, he's a, a, a war captain, yeah. and now he's out reading the news. He's not a, a, a very, you know, particularly like dynamic character. I'm not character. saying he's that not his character to has to be dynamic. What I'm saying is that the arc of his character was not dynamic. His, his, the arc of his character was very static. I've been, he was he was concentrating on getting this girl where she needed to get to, and there are so many care. and there's so many places in this movie where it, it, all kinds of crazy stuff comes out of left field. There is danger at every turn, of and course. it's captivating. And that it's was very the only thing that too. was interesting was when the danger came out of every turn when you when they're having to actually have some western battles and uh, it becomes a western in those moments. It did. It felt like a good western. Be- those were the best parts of the film. I will agree and with you on scene, that. And the scene, the scene. This is a big <laughs> movie you want to see on the big screen. Yeah, it is I gorgeous yeah, it shots was okay. of Texas. It was okay. I don't think it was great. Well, what's great is the we car horn. horn, and the horn means we're going to rate this film on a five star scale. And Eric's going to start. 
I uh, I liked every bit of this. Actually, I every think this bit? is yeah. I think this is one of Tom Hanks's better films what? in recent times. Eric. I really do. Yes, yes. Uh, I think I do think uh, Helen Zengel did a, a brilliant job Agreed. with j just having to act with her eyes most yeah. of the time, not really communicating. Kid was good, but I think the combination of the two of them communicating without being able to communicate so well, and all the action, this the beautiful vistas, it shot brilliantly. Great supporting cast. I really like this film. Four and four stars, solid four stars, very solid. Like eh, maybe even generous. a touch more than that. Generous. No, it's that Super good. Super generous. Well, tell me your you thoughts. You want to see a western shot with beautiful vistas in a similar area, not quite Texas, but it's close. News of the Go world. Go watch The Searchers, the original John Ford film with John Wayne. That has beautiful vistas. You want to watch it with John this Wayne? You can't like do that. It looked like a desert. It didn't even look. It wasn't interesting at all to me. Why? The way it this looked like a desert. I did not like the vistas. I did not like the Come cinematography. On. I did not like the perform. Well, the performances were bad. There were some of them were good. Uh, I really liked Helena Zengel. I agree with Eric Ooh. on that. Tom Hanks was super boring. Super the same Hating all the way Hanks. through the film. It's not a hate have Hanks because I want to hate Hanks. I love Hanks. He seems like the coolest guy ever. Yes. I'd love to have dinner with Hanks, but I don't want to watch this movie again with Hanks. And for that reason, I gave this film two and a half stars. 2.5. That's it. Man, I'm right. Almighty. He's wrong. And we're done. The opposite of what he said. Except for the done part, because we are done. We That's are all done. the time we've got. So check it out for yourselves. You're going to have to figure it out. Check it out. You can agree like with it. Me. Don't like it. Don't You'll like agree it. with me. You will. Trust me. That's it for this episode. Thank you so much for Thank watching. Thank you so much for uh, watching. Please. Please share your comments share. down below. Uh, liking our videos and subscribing it's makes lovely. us uh, it makes us very happy. Makes us what Puts now? Big smiles. Happy. Puts, it gives us what? It makes us happy. Yes. Do but that. But until next time, we are the three pretty. <laughs> Battery run out. <laughs>